So, sir, you must be a very satisfied man. You've created Telangana. Your name is forever in history. Thank is you. it the end of the road or the beginning of the road for you? It's two way pranayaj <laughs> because I'm a, I feel I'm a blessed man yes. that I could accomplish my moment yes. Huge. In, my, in my lifetime. Huge. I've touched the goal. I'm a very satisfied, very happy man. Now we, I need to take out my society from the trauma. But you know, over the years, Telangana has been a relatively backward path. Will not, will not require a lot of resources to bring it up to a... And where will those resources come from? Sir, as a matter of fact, as if you look at the history, sir, while merging these two states, Telangana was a rich state. Telangana was always with a surplus budget and Andhra was a deficit budget. It's not that Telangana was backward, sir. Telangana was pushed into backwardness. It was pushed. So now I think we have sufficient resource. There are a lot of people from Andhra who still live in Telangana and Hyderabad and some of the areas around it. They are, they are feeling very insecure because you're quite aggressive towards them. What is it? Is that aggression going to continue or is that roll over? Pranayji, I'm very clear in my mind. I'm a progressive thinker. I want Telangana should flourish. Telangana should develop. I am not against Andhras. I am not against the people of Andhra. My slogan has been always, जो खाना कमाने के लिए यहाँ आया, उनसे हमारा कोई जंग नहीं है। जो हमारा खाना लूटने के लिए आया, उनसे ही हमारा जंग है। So it's very clear to me that it's only your first innings that's over, Telangana. You're already ready for the second innings. Yes, sir. So in the second innings, there are two aspects. There's both assembly and Lok Sabha going on. In the Lok Sabha, it's Mr. Modi and versus Rahul Gandhi. How do you compare the two? See, comparing, comparing these two... I mean, what two, do you think of them? The, the best thing is not to compare these two. Yes, separately. It's always equation and situation which really works out in politics. The present equation and situation out of my experience, my little experience, it's neither it is going to be Rahul Gandhi nor it is going to be Narendra Modi. It is going to be some other face represented by third front kind of situation. So what do you think of them as two leaders? Of course, they are leaders of their own party. Hmm. Why should I comment anything against them or for them? But one of the parties is actually close to tying up with you. What happened? You were close to tying up with the Congress and then suddenly you're fighting separately. What happened? Yes, it was. It was. But the, I can suddenly say the approach, arrogant approach of Congress erratic approach of the second rung leaders of All India Congress Committee has really... Second rung leaders, you, you had already met Sonia Gandhi, things seem to have worked no, out. I met, I met Mr. Digvijay Singh, Mr. Jairam Ramesh, I met him. Jairam Ramesh came to my residence in Delhi. So many others also met me. So then what went wrong? Me. I don't know what happened. The day I came from Delhi, next day to my surprise, I see in the newspapers, he spoke so, so much against me. Who? Mr. Jairam Ramesh. Here, people have no faith in Congress. The same old kind of thing they are following Congress. People want a change here. So why did you even engage? One thing is for sure, I can certainly say it. Because I can't lie to anybody. I have some good regards for Sonia Gandhi. Definitely, I have to say that. Because of her initiative, only Telangana became possible. I am openly saying it. She was the main reason behind the formation of Telangana. But the second rank leaders after, after Sonia Gandhi, they played the spoil sport. When you talk about Sonia Gandhi, you almost get emotional. Certainly. She, she is the reason behind it. Because I cannot lie to my own consciousness. So when Mr. Modi, what's his impact been here in his speeches here in Hyderabad, in Telangana? Sir, I can tell you the tragedy of Mr. Narendra Modi in Telangana. Um, it is to the misfortune of Mr. Narendra Modi. He played into the hands of very wrong people, into the trap of Mr. Benkei Naidu and Chandra Babu Naidu. You feel he hasn't got the pulse of Telangana? 
I I don't know sir, but why why he spoiled himself? Why he killed himself in Telangana? He must only know. And Rahul has he got the pulse of Telangana? Rahul is of course to, still too yet too mature. He cannot be compared to Sonia ji. And who? So in your campaign, who's your main political opponent? Party wise. No, finally the fight will be in between TRS and Congress. Only. Congress. So if Mr. Modi asks you. Please come and support us at the center. We won't support. No question. No question. I I may tell you at the end of this. I may tell you one thing. The glory, the glorious history of my Telangana. Telangana is famously known to the whole world for its Ganga Jamuna Tehsi. Ganga Jamuna Tehsi. Ganga Jamuna ka jo sangam hota hai. Yeah. Us prakar ka yahan Hindu Muslim. मिलके रहने का। Just like you said no to Mr. Modi, if Rahul has a, needs your support to form a government, would you say okay to Rahul Gandhi? Hundred percent. If he if he becomes prime minister with my support, hundred percent I'll be the first person to support. So it's quite tough on the ground. Your main opponent is the Congress, but actually there is an underlying alliance also. It's a critical situation. What should I do? Yes. Is the Congress who will ask the whole? That's thing? politics. That's politics. I can't <laughs> help it. The Congress who really, who's, who played the spoil sport. So thank you so much. Thank you thank and you. good luck. Sir. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.